Right guys, Joe here, and we're going to be carrying on with Crisis 2. For any updates, uh, I'm just about to carry on with Nathan Gould, he's just, I've just got into his apartment, and I'm going to be looking at some sort of computer he's got ready. Geek conspiracy nut, for Christ's sake. God damn it! Prophet was supposed to get us out. The Marines were coming for us. Now... Know what he think about cephalopods? Hmm? Dumb question, right? Of course you don't. Well, you want the dumbed-down version? We're getting our asses kicked out there, like Calamari. You ever wonder what the Aztecs and the Incas felt like when they saw smallpox for the first time? I mean, you've seen the spore, right? Seen what it does? Prophet kept saying he'd found an answer to that. Scan complete. Warning. That's not possible. Uncalibrated nano This has got to be... All right, 21%. that suit you're wearing, it's built out of a self-repairing, semi-organic nano-weave patented by the Hargreave Rash Corporation. Yeah, that Hargreave. He designed the stuff. Prophet w was Spec Ops. Hargreave recruited him to wear the suit, but he went AWOL, came back talking some semi-sane shit, and then... See that? That's a viral subroutine running in the suit's deep layers. It's like living code, and it's... I don't know, it's, it's like it's rewriting itself to accommodate something new. A fresh data file, maybe. My best guess? What you're looking at there is the biocoding for some kind of vaccine against the spore. Have to get that stuff decoded. And I can't do that here. I just don't have the processing power. I, I need to. God damn it. 
The only place in New York that stuff exists is in Hargreaves' lab on Roosevelt Island. The prism. And that's miles uptown. It, it'd be suicide trying to get there right now with the seven. <laughs> Shit! They're here! Shit! Shit! Oh no. Things are going to shit now. One there. One there. And the cells will have to be. Let's get him. Where the hell do we go? Downstairs? What? Is it going on? Alright. So, if you were watching that, basically my suit is trying to decode an antivirus, but he needs help and he can't do it here. So I need to go to a prison on Roosevelt Island or something. So that that's the only place where the actual next computer is. Oh well, seems like fun, eh? But we're getting close to him. Man down! Another man down! Another man down. Oh, sneaky! I tried to be sneaky, didn't be. Let's see where the rest of them are. Hello. Hold mouse two. Bye. Stupid idiots. <laughs> Some of them are completely and utterly noobish. Ooh, feline. The sniper is useless in, his, useless in this position, I think. Well, I think it is anyway. Someone, anyone else's way of playing probably a lot better than mine, to be fair. Sorry, that just looks awesome. Bloody hell. <laughs> I know you're not getting the same visuals as me, but that did look pretty damn epic. Again, that's the end of that level. So, I'm going to end the video there. Before I get started, and then that, that, that was video less of me talking as well. The more of the game was giving you some story. That's what it is. He needs me to go to Roosevelt Island where the prison is so they can get the processing power to scan the lower levels of my suit. I'm telling you because the sound of him speaking is actually really jittering, it's loading because of the filming. And that is gonna hopefully mean I'm gonna have to save the world. Well, my suit's gonna save the world. Well, me as well, you know, large part of it. Being all skillful and awesome. Because that's what I do. That's what I do. And, um, yeah. Basically, when this loads, I'm gonna end this video. Can't do it now because uh, sometimes it crashes and screws up my videos. But I'm gonna have to talk. I know it's a short video, but I'm, I'm, I hope you won't mind. And uh, I do hope you look forward to next time when you get to see the start of the next level. Alright, guys, this is it. 
I hope to see you next time and thanks. Bye.